They won't catch us. Ah, uh, they can't catch us. They don't even have a clue. We're escaping. We're, we're running from the law, you see. Lately in our home country of Akrima, laws and human rights have been butchered by our new dictator. Taxes have even rose to 3,000 pentons a week. It's terrible. Ready. We're ready to escape. We can't take the hush new laws and taxes! Yeah! We'll start a new society. Maybe even a country. Man the ship. Yes, sir! Ready? Got all the cargo? Yes, sir. Well, what are we waiting for, then? Viva Kamen! Well, I'm sure you've seen our first voyage video, and it's a year later now, and Covenland is flourishing. The land we found is huge, like the size of Alaska. It's even got two rivers, two lakes, and a huge island with caverns and caves on it. They're really big, too. Check it out on this map. Here's General Von Bulk to show you about how we work our electricity on this island. Feverite out. Hello. I am General Edward Von Bock. I am in charge of the military capital in the city of Lenara, located in North Covenant. But right now I'm here to tell you how we manage our electricity. When we took our cargo ship on the first voyage, we took many building materials such as steel and wood. First, our main electricity field is a source of wind, mo wind power mills that are in a field in North Maya. It's the city in between the cities of Daniel and Savannah. Our secondary source is water wheels. They are easy to build and we have many on the Vestan River. They provide energy for our computers, lights, and, well, everything. Thank you. Hi, Fede back. One of our co-mates, Ashde Nore, is going to tell us about our hunting and gathering policy. Here she is. Hiya. I'm here to tell you all about us, how us Covenlanders get our food. Since the likes of most Covenland is trees and forest, we get a lot of our food from fruit trees. We unfortunately only have three native fruit trees, that of the apple, olive, and pomegranate. But we also take other kinds of tree seeds from our old home, secretly that is. As for meats, guns we imported from Ak Arama from our first voyage cover that. But our famous farming capital, Sarah, takes care of most of that nowadays. And that about covers it for food. Hi, it's Vivi again. Well, since I was the one who decided to leave Akram on the first place in Front Coverland, it's only natural that I'm president. We're only two years into developing, so we have no branches of government as of now. But later on, when we're all spiffied up and most of our cities are built, then government will come into place. I don't know if this counts, but we're working on a police system and a hospital system. But right now it seems all old and dry with the sheriffs and local town doctors. Lame, I know. Oh, Mr. Kvenich needs to tell you something. Be right back. Hey, I'm Mr. Kvenich. I am the only one allowed to leave Covenant. Well, me and my crew. We are the ones who return to Akuma to get more supplies, such as building materials. I guess you could say we're smuggling the things from Akrama. Smuggle's not a good word, but that's the only thing I could think of at the moment. We still use the Akramanian money of Pentons to buy our things, but later we'll come up with our own money system. Thanks for listening. Hey, I'm Louis Dinello. I'm in charge of the community rules and jobs. Here in Covenant, you don't need applications. You simply demonstrate whether you're good at the job or not by performing it and right in front of the owner of the business, then if he or she says if you're good at it or not, you might get the job, or you won't. Back to the laws and such, which I really don't care about. Such is our standard right now, moment is that core democratic values are common good, or the power to help one another. Well, that's all I have to say. Oh, yeah, and I am the leader of the, you know, community thing. Everybody thinks so anyways, because, you know, I'm just cool like that. Well, my name is Louie. That is the coolest name, you know. Well, anyways, Louie out. Hey, I'm Natalia Danello. Oh, wait, that guy you listened to before, Louie? Yeah, he's my, like, brother. He's such a weirdo. He's so cocky, and he's, like, show-off and crap, as you can see. I just hate him. So annoying. Anyways, I'm here to tell you about how us Covenlanders transport from place to place. Yeah, we use bikes, because it's inexpensive, and you get a good workout. 
we don't waste our stuff on cars, like metals and stuff on our cars. We just go by bike. Well, for as for water travel, most of us poor people, middle classers, whatever, use canoes and rowboats. I know, pretty lame. But if you're lucky, you can get a jet ski, a ski boat, things like that. Well, anyways, just just don't talk to Louie. He's, he'll just show off. But anyways, Natalia Danello, out. Thanks for watching. That was all about Covenland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.